We welcome you in the Sweets Post Game presented by Cascade Natural Gas. We're joined alongside today's high efficiency player of the game, Kenny Haro. We kind of mentioned a little bit. If you don't want to be talking to me, <laughs> just don't play well. So you keep playing well. You keep talking to me. I'll take it at. I'll take it as a compliment. But. In a, in a way, welcome back in, in a spot like this. Talking about today's game, you were absolutely outstanding. Four hits in big spots as well, driving in a run or two. Let's go on that. Back in what we mentioned, hammered in a ton about working the top of the order, bringing that spark. I believe third straight game, maybe fourth straight game, you've let off and got on base. How important, continuing to talk about that, how important is it to bring that energy into the top of the order for the Swedes? Yeah, I mean, starting every game, um, I know my role, just to get on base any way I can. Um, you know, it helps the team build some momentum, like we've talked about before. Um, just trying to do my do my job. Yeah. Well, kind of adding on to that, a lot of things that Manager Molina has talked a lot about is opportunistic hitting, working with runners in the scoring position, extending innings. You guys did that a ton today. Had the big inning, really everything coming with two outs. How much has he pr uh, really pressured you guys into a spot like that and focusing on working two outs and in spots where you need a run? Yeah, with the score like this, and um, it's definitely a team effort, yeah. and we definitely came up with some big hits in some big situations. And, you know, we just try to keep it simple. Um, uh, yeah, just uh, <laughs> um, with two outs, just try to get on base and – not let the situation just get too big. Yeah, and that's definitely what it's kind of seemed like, kind of settling it down in a way. Uh -huh. That's really what it's kind of looked like for a lot of guys, especially yourself, at the plate. Defensively, we'll go and talk a little bit about that before we came in to do this interview. You mentioned Hitaro and how well he pitched today. Pitching in the last few have been has been excellent and helps you guys offensively and defensively, knowing you have a guy that's going to pitch that well. Talk about his start and how he worked. Yeah. Uh, setting the tone the first inning at a home game um, fires us up every every time he gets us going you know it's almost like we want to back him up because he's throwing such a great game um, and you know we don't have to worry about uh, pitching as much we can focus on hitting and getting him some runs it very much again settles things down uh, for the sweets Going on a completely different direction and kind of what I was saying on the broadcast, we gave you a little bit of a nickname due to the walk-up. Uh, it is easily one of the best in a Hawaiian roller coaster from Lilo and Stitch soundtrack. Before I even talk about the nickname first, let's go and talk about that song. Obviously, from Hawaii, is that a movie like you just loved growing up? Because in my family out in New Jersey, it was a big one. We like It was the best Disney movie in my family, so it means a lot to me as well. But for you, holding a little bit more weight uh, f for you and especially using it as a walk up yeah I wanted to choose something that had some meaning um, not just like rap yeah. or something but I like to keep my walk up songs a little chiller on the vibe so I could you know relax in the box I don't get tensed up um, but yeah it's a great song it is and it does quite that there's no better way to start off a ball game than hearing that kind of intro so it's very cool but then with that Gave you the little bit of a nickname with the Hawaiian roller coaster. How does that feel? You got you're one of the first sweets with a nickname this year. Yeah, I mean, I think it's a great nickname. Kind of, kind of plays into my game, yeah. I guess. Yeah. yeah, I like it a lot. Yeah. There was the one, and I think this is the first time I broke it out with a pop fly like in a right, uh -huh. where you're going all twisted on it, uh -huh. and make the grab. Hawaiian roller coaster does it oh, again yeah. in Candy Horror. Candy, <laughs> appreciate your time. This has been Sweets Post Game. The Sweets take it by a 10 3 margin, your final from Borleski tonight. Sweets go on the road for six before they're back at home for the 4th of July. But once again, Kennedy, thank you for your time. Sweets win it. This has been Sweets Post Game presented by Cascade Natural Gas.